I'm back. <laughs> okay, so here is the travel capsule wardrobe, the one that I shoved into that tiny little compression cube. Now, it looks like a whole lot whenever I've got it out here. Let me show you why. Okay, so here we actually have seven tops. Seven, I know, it, it's a lot. So we have the button-up shirt. Probably my favorite shirt that I own. It's so comfortable. I wear it all the time. So we have that. We have the standard black tank top, which everybody has one. I know you have to have a standard black tank top somewhere in your whole wardrobe because, well, mostly so you can wear it up under things like my fabulous button-up shirt. So those two go together for the most part. Um, I have this shirt, which I recently added to the compression cube and it fits. Yay. Okay. So, uh, I realized that I hadn't packed anything if I was going to go to someplace like really nice that I needed to look kind of fancy because I might actually do that. And I actually have plans to do that. So there's a couple of places I plan on going that's going to require me to dress a little bit nicer. So I found this shirt recently at a local shop and the best thing about it is that I can crumple it into a ball. This thing is not going to wrinkle and it looks fabulous on me. So that kind of helped too. <laughs> All right. And then we have the t-shirts. So these are the two t-shirts that I had packed in the compression cube. So there's a blue one and there's a black one and they are the sand wash dolman tees from lucky brand. Now I get them in both medium and large. This one's a medium and this one's a large. So this one fits a little bit smaller and that's okay. This one fits a bit bigger, so it's much looser, and that's also okay. So I particularly like these ones because they're made of bamboo. Yeah, neat. I like it. Remember? Sustainable. Minimalism. Blah, blah, blah. So they're made of bamboo. I like them. And they wash very well, and they dry very quickly, and they barely wrinkle, if they wrinkle at all. So this is after, actually. Like, I can even show you. This is... This is after they've been in that compression cube for like two weeks because I packed it and then kind of just left it because I am me. Okay, so this is the other t-shirt I'm bringing. Also, the Sandwash Dolman from Lucky Brand. A large, a white one. I think this is large, yeah. This is a large one. It's a white one. Underneath it, there's a white tank top. This is what I'm wearing on the plane. I know boring, right? But not really, actually. It's, there's a reason for it. I like to wear tank tops up underneath my clothes. Even now I'm wearing a tank top up underneath my t-shirt because it's just something that I got into the habit of doing. Um, it actually makes the clothes on top last longer and it's much easier for me to just wash tank tops in the sink than it is to always just wash my t-shirts or like wash my button ups, things like that. So I tend to wash the stuff that actually gets sweaty, which is my undergarments. And then like, I don't have to wash this much stuff this often. So, yay. Anyway, airport clothes. All right, that's it for tops. Altogether, that's seven tops for 12 days. It's doable, right? Like to me, totally doable, not a problem. I don't even have to wash everything that often, but there is going to be times I'm going to have to wash things, specifically the tank tops. All my tank tops have to be washed because if I wear them once, they're going to get sweaty and gross and they have to be washed. So I'll wash those every night, hang them up to dry. They'll be good to go by morning. And I'm, I already showed you my system for that. So yay. Okay. Next up we have bottoms. Here there are four pairs of bottoms. Four. Okay. Three of which, these three, are in the compression cube. These fit in the compression cube with all of these lovely tops, except for this one. So we'll start with the first pair. Shorts. Yeah, just a pair of, yeah, torn up old denim shorts. I, I wear these all the time. These are my favorite shorts. They are very comfortable. They fit me very well. They don't show too much. And uh, they go with all my shirts. So denim shorts. Next we have the thin, almost linen-like black pants. Yay. These ones I actually replaced the other pair with because the other pair, 
I like them and they are more linen like however when they wash they tend to get a film on them from the different soaps so I didn't want to deal with something like that since I don't have any way to like really like get that out while I'm you know overseas so instead I'm bringing these ones which I have washed and they work fine and they're just little cargo like capri type pants very comfortable fit very well they cover my knees so I can go into temples that's all that matters really is I just wanted a pair of pants that could cover my knees that are also like a very very light material so it's breathable and if it gets wet these dry really fast because they're athletic style so there's those and then we have my skirt that's it it's my skirt looks short it's really it's not that short it just looks a lot shorter than it is and it fits really nice it's very comfortable actually because it's stretchy stretchy is the way to go because you know I've had two kids so stretchy is the way to go everything must be stretchy <laughs> okay so there's the skirt and here is the last pair of pants on a hanger these these are my pants for the flight elastic waist stretchy look like denim very comfortable thick enough so I won't get cold but thin enough that I'm not gonna get overheated either so these were a very good buy I'm very proud of them I very much like them they're super comfy all right so that is all the bottoms I'm taking with me that is four bottoms now, how often I'm going to have to wash these bottoms. The jean shorts, I will not wash. I will not wash them at the hotel. The jean shorts, if they get gross, if they get anything on them, I will spot clean them. Otherwise, they'll probably just get wet with ocean water. I'll wring them out, let them dry. That's gonna be it, yeah. So, yeah. Um, the skirt, I'm only actually planning on wearing twice, maybe three times, probably just twice though. While I'm gone, once with the fancy shirt, and once with one of these shirts, which it also looks fabulous with, so it works. Um, but I'm gonna be wearing these pants and these shorts an awful lot <laughs> because I have a lot of places I wanna go that are gonna require either I wear shorts because I'm gonna be outside doing a lot of outside stuff and generally I wear shorts when I do that, or I'm going to be going to temples because I like temples, they're really cool. They're really pretty and I want to take all the pictures because they're super awesome okay so that's it for clothes in my packing cube I know aren't you excited I'm excited let's be excited so excited okay so here is my jacket this is my jacket that I'm gonna be wearing on the plane okay it's actually two jackets two jackets why because the under jacket is just a thin jersey knit very thin jersey knit hoodie zip up hoodie that's all it is it's by hurley it's in a men's size medium very comfortable but also very lightweight it's just enough to cover my arms if i get sunburned but it's not so thick that i'm gonna die of like heat exhaustion so it it will protect me if i end up needing it to protect me the other one is a slightly thin but not quite as um rain jacket it's like a windbreaker rain jacket and that is because I did not want to take the time and the energy to find the perfect umbrella to fit in my pack I just don't want to do that and umbrellas don't always work for me they just don't because if it's windy then my umbrella is just gonna go flying away congratulations umbrella you found a new home in a foreign country yeah so we're not gonna let that happen That's my travel outfit and these shoes. Like I said, they're that thin mesh material, very thin mesh material. They have the slip on back so I can just slide my feet in and out of them. Mm -hmm. And they're easily washable. Very, very easily washable. Yeah, so I don't have to worry about them getting stinky or overly dirty or anything like that. And they're just basic running shoes yeah um, and then of course you know the flip-flops which are gonna go with most of this most of the time because 
Hey, Jeff. And then here is that beautiful, oops, here is that beautiful rainbow sarong. Also my beach towel, also a wraparound skirt for if I wear shorts and I happen to come across a place where I need to cover myself. Um, yeah, so it's gonna be doing all the things, all the things, most utilitarian, beautiful rainbow sarong you've ever seen. That's it folks, that's all of it. I know, really doesn't seem like a lot. But at the same time, kind of seems like a lot. But all of this fit into that backpack. Minus, of course, my travel outfit, which fits right here. Heck yeah. So that's that's all of it. That's all I got to show you today. All right? Okay. Stop watching the video. No, really. Like, go away.